Going through this ladder drill. One. Now two. One, two. All right. Listen to the sound of the rope. You want each crossover to have the same rhythm, tempo, timing. What's cracking Jump Nation family? It's your boy here, Rushi S, aka The Jump Rope Coach. Welcome back to the home of Jump Rope Fitness and Lifestyle People today. We've got a killer two minute tutorial Tuesday. And it's actually coming out on a Tuesday, hopefully. Um, gonna be teaching you guys how to do your crossovers super perfect, right? And that's a little drill that I mentioned back in the day. We're talking like four or five years ago when I first started this channel. But it's a really good drill to get you guys doing your crossovers, doing them perfect, get the technique right and just building in a lot of muscle memory all right so we're gonna get straight into this one remember if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button join our incredible army growing across the world today i always say we're well, the best thing that has happened to cardio since i can't think of anything right now definitely not treadmills but let's get straight into this guys remember use the links down below cop our ropes cop our mats get yourself started the right way so crossovers right now this is like i think this is a tutorial really for the beginners going into intermediates. So crossovers right now, this is probably like a beginner going into intermediate now. If you're someone who could probably do a crossover with a boxer step right now, or maybe you're at a basic balance here and you can basically do this kind of thing, or you're even here with a run, okay now. But what happens is when you start to try and do more of them, you try and go fast and you trip, all right? So this drill is gonna help you get done with that, all right? That was just a little intro to that, yeah? So we're resetting the two minutes now. Here we now, here we now starting, okay? So here's a drill, people, okay? I want you to get into the step that you're most comfortable with. Let's say it's a boxer step, or again, if you're a basic bounce or a run. I'm gonna start with a boxer step. So you're here. What I want you to do is just get into a rhythm using side swings with your boxer step, side, side, cross, yeah? That's one. Now we move up the ladder. One, two, back to boxer. Now three, here. One, two, three. And what I'm trying to do when I'm doing this ladder drill is I'm trying to get every single crossover the same as the one before, right? So we're trying to imitate, clone. We're not trying to come out of the step. We're not trying to increase the speed. We're just literally keeping all the fundamentals the same. So my fundamentals, we cross here, all right? At the elbows, never at the wrist. That's what's gonna to lead to a breakdown. You're gonna have a narrower rope here. You wanna be here, feel like you're hugging yourself. And also our wrist positioning, which I talk about a lot, we're trying to get our thumbs. You want the feeling to kind of feel like your thumbs are facing behind you. It might not look like that, but it's a feeling. So if you have that feeling, we hug ourselves. Going through this ladder drill, one. Now two, one, two. All right, listen to the sound of the rope. You want each crossover to have the same rhythm, tempo, timing. Now, when you're feeling confident with that, we're getting to four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Change up the step. So I'm gonna go for a light run here, side swing. One, one, two, all right? Make sure I got that whip. One, two, three. Making sure my posture's good. Yeah. And remember your body alignment, we don't wanna be too far over, we don't wanna be too upright. If you get too upright now, guys, with these crossovers, we're gonna make this rope short. So you wanna have a bit of body tilt, but similarly, you don't wanna be down here yeah, because then you're just gonna look a bit booky, it's gonna look a bit whack. So you want a little bit of body tilt. I'm gonna spin this way, we're gonna use this camera right now. I'm gonna use a little bit of body tilt like this. Little hunch, boom. Make that cross happen, boom. Get those hands crossing. One, two, and then three. One, two, three. Now your goal, guys, really short tutorial. Your goal is to try and go for as long as possible when you're doing this within a workout, if you can get to 30, 40, 50s up this ladder, you'll be out of breath like I am. Your heart's gonna be moving, you're burning calories for fun, and at the same time, you're gonna be again, smoothing out, making these crossovers look super, super fluid, super effortless, and when it comes down to doing combos, drills, transitions, whatever you do, it's gonna look really, really slick and fire, as I always say. So, hope that helped, guys. Just a two minute tutorial, probably went over it as always. Thank you for the love and support. Hopefully this drill will help you out. Give me a comment 
down below. Let me know if you find it useful. Drop me a like. And uh, let me know what you want to see going forward. I'll get it done for you as always. So take care of yourself. Let's get the treadmill. Stay safe. Peace. Was the knight in shining armor in your movie? Would put your lips on mine and love the aftertaste now.